Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Treasure of the Rudras. I am your host, Melee Wizard, and I should be off to Mantra Peak, but I want to see what's over here first. Nothing. Okay. <laughs> and the best way I could think of to head over there is through the Heg Shrine. Because I believe there was a he another Heg Shrine over by Mantra Peak. Let's hope I remember correctly. Uh, I, th I think it would be assuming a a uh, at least spherical if not toroidal world that it should be up here somewhere maybe to the more to the west maybe uh, I'm not oh well, there's Lila, right? I think. Though apparently I can't go there. Well, that's interesting. Though I don't think... I think that's Viracona again, so I don't think I'm going the right way. It should be over this way, I think. Aha, here we are. Why is it I always seem to find the longest path to get somewhere? Hey, there's there's a cat creature out here that does a heck of a lot of damage. So now I have to find my way through this place again. Great. So I can only imagine what Zora will have to tell me. Probably something cryptic. Something that'll take me way too much effort to try to figure out. Here we are. I've been sending my visions to that old Kutseku. Wait. Now that the Sky Islands have fallen, things are beginning to get critical. Soon the moonlight will appear and erase humanity in its entirety. Nature has been purified, but our, our, our survival isn't certain by a long shot. It's time the power of the Chosen was tested. Yep. Somebody's got to counter the blundering of the other tape pairs. Oh, jeez, really? Uh -huh. To prevent our race from dis... Yeah. Uh, right. There's so way too much stuff going on above our heads right now. Right then. <laughs> A sign from the goddess, huh? So I have to go back to Karn again? Really? Oh, jeez. Thank. I guess it should be thankful that it doesn't take long to get to. So, what sign am I going to be looking for exactly? I wonder. Maybe the water will recede mysteriously. That would be a good sign, right? And it's still night of day 11, right? Yeah. So... I guess I should be thankful that there aren't any uh, random encounters while we're on the Hague. That would make things a lot more irritating than it needs to be right now. So just head back to Karn and see what takes place. Because what other option do I have right now?
So maybe, maybe Zeku has something to tell me now, afterwards. Uh, well maybe the dogs have something to tell me. Okay. Statue? What statue are the, the dogs referring to, I wonder? I can't go that way. Huh. Well, maybe it's in here. E huh. Okay. Nah, I don't think I need to go there yet. I don't, I don't think I that would accomplish much. And there's... Was that boat always there? Uh, so we're going to the Statue of May for now. And there's day 12. Oh my. My, oh my. Ahem. I, n I, oh no. <laughs> I am afraid of what I'm gonna find there. So I think, I think I'm going to head back out here and save, and I'm going to, I guess, put this off as long as I can. I'm going to switch over back to Scion, so I'll see you in a sec. All right, so let's see what the, what the, this guy has to tell us, what he wants us for. Ah, he's not here. He, maybe he's upstairs. Maybe he has the key to that one door. Ah, there he is. So what do you want to tell us here? What happened? Seems like everybody in Denelf's barricaded themselves at home. The birth of Rudra draws near. Uh, the myths speak of moonlight preceding the Rudra's arrival. Deadly beams from the skies which irradiate er eradicate life in an instant. The myths, alas, appear to have become reality. Oh, that's lovely. If this is the cult's doing, no destroyer god no oh dear. King Cryun is growing concerned about Mistress Zora's well being. We have to go to Mantra Peak too! There is little love lost between them, but they still remain in contact. However, it has been some time since we heard anything from Mantra Peak. There is a possibility that she may have been in contact with Taurus. Oh, really? Oh, okay. So, we should pay a visit to the king. Alright. Uh, okay, what else do you want? Taurus Sword! Hello! Oh, really? Ah, so we were supposed to get a prize. Oh, well, that's nice. Oh, yeah, I forgot that he was the guy that we fought. Okay. Um, uh-oh. What? Um, and there goes the gong. Oh, dear. Well, that's great. The Chosen has left our world? Okay, that makes me more nervous about what Ryza is doing. Oh boy. Oh dear, oh dear. What is Mayfa going to be doing? So, we're gonna have to go through Mantra Peak again, and... Did I check to see if there was any better gear in here? Ah, uh, yes I did, okay. So, off to see the king, I guess. Ah, I forgot to check to see if that new sword I got, how strong the thing is. 
Ooh. And it's single-handed, too. Nice. So, can we get in here now? It's not even guarded. Why does that strike fear in me right now? Oh, really? Vanish? What do you mean, vanish? Okay, what the heck's going on? Zion, are you safe? Yeah. Has he now? Doug is preparing a boat for you at Denelf. Take it to Mantra Peak and... Oh, it's a... Okay. Alrighty. From what I understand, Taurus is now in the Netherworld. It is there that the cult maintains its base. Oh, well, that's great. That's just great. <laughs> so, back to Denelf, I guess. Um, was there better gear in... And it's day 13. <laughs> oh, jeez. Time seems to be going by a little bit. Uh, wow. Uh, nope, nothing here for us. It was worth a look, if nothing else. Uh, do I want to do this now? The thing is, I've already forgotten what's going on in what Sir Lent was up to at this point. Uh, I guess if nothing else I should see what Zora has to tell this group. And with any luck, I, this won't take me to day 14 right off the bat. Uh, okay, where's the boat? Ah, there's the, there's the dock. Ah. Say what? Oh, there you are. What, what? Um, uh, okay. Mr. Zora said that you'd be going to the... That, she said that? Uh, okay. <laughs> Alright then. So, Gunna says... I don't know, has this group been to the netherworld before? I don't know. And it's... Day 13. Or the night of day 13, I guess. Okay. If nothing else, I'm getting some plot stuff out of the way. Okay, off we go to find this lady. It's going a different direction. Oh! What? What do you mean, secured Mantra Peak? Oh, you. Uh uh. Oh, th this will not stand. Ray Igmel, huh? Uh <laughs> Yeah, you have no shot. what I tell ya? <laughs> oh, jeez. What's going. What has taken. Oh, shit. Shoot. Really? In the span of a few hours? In the span of half a day? Ravana? Oh dear. Yeah. <laughs> a Knight of Cryune, yes. Time to take you out, Horig Mel. Ooh, that one was a little stronger. Unfortunately, you're not. Oh, crap. Oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. This is not good. Ah. 
<sighs> if these cultists are using fire magic, then I've already got the water one set up. Okay. So, was it up here? Darn it, everyone, stop attacking Tor! Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, let's go! Oh my goodness, what the heck is that? R Ravana? <laughs> so you say. Oh, not if we have anything to say about it. Thanks to the Jade Bearers, your work's being undone one bit at a time. Ha! <laughs> oh dear. Nah, -uh, you are not that. We are not letting you do that. Ha! <laughs> oh. We are not the fool, I think. Ra Igmel, and oh geez, that does a good bit of damage. But the thing is, I think we can too. Uh, so. Uh, I'm actually gonna have you healing. And me thinks I'm worried that that might not be. Oh shoot. Please do a lot of damage. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, but at the moment, he thinks. Uh, yeah, double double healing should do do us some good. Although it doesn't look like we're gonna be living long enough. Crap. Oh dear. This is going to suck, especially if he keeps spamming that. Oh dear. Yeah, this is not good. This is not good at all. And he's just going to keep on spamming that thing. It's, I just wonder how much fire defense I've got here. Because that's kind of a thing that I need to know. Because Ramalith can't be the only one that has fire defense. I, I, I'm sure he does at the moment, but... And everyone's pretty much dead now. Yeah. Let's just see how much damage I can do to this thing. Whoa. What the heck? I at least want to see if I can bring him down into some form of red. Which, no, doesn't look like it. Alright. And I... hadn't saved since then. Great. Um, if anything, I'll see you back at Montrepeak after I take care of all that. See you in a sec. Alright, I'm back here again, and just to summarize what changes I made, I basically everyone gave everyone fire defense, though I had to uh, buy some Cassie's mail for Foxy to do it to get it for her. Everyone else pretty much had what they needed on hand. So, let's go do this. Yeah, you just enjoy causing pain, don't you? Makes sense. That seems like an odd impact noise, but oh well. Maybe it wasn't an impact. So, let's see how much damage you do with everyone having fire defense. <laughs> it's a lot more manageable now. Uh, so just everyone spam your strongest and you heal. <laughs> I 
Yeah, I think we can outpace the, the damage output right now. That way we can just cause a whole lot of damage to him. Oh yeah, we're definitely outpacing him on damage. So just do what we can. And was, is that single target? Yes, it is single target. And it does a decent amount, but it's nothing we can't handle right now. So, dang, he's... It took about 3,000 damage to do that much. Okay. Uh... Well, she's out. Um, I'm gonna have you heal next. And have you used the attack and... What the heck is that? Kuko Ness? Okay. That's decent, I guess. Maybe. But here's another 1500 damage to you. Uh, oop, I, she, he can do one more. And... Yeah. Just keep using that stuff. We can we can take it from here. <laughs> it's nice that Roxy's got the water aligned weapon. And she could do a good bit of damage and whew, took him out. <laughs> and everyone gains a level. Nice. So yeah, is she alright? Oh, she actually, she's actually okay! Good! Alright, so we can go in there now! And so you didn't let us go in there before. Uh -huh. Many races retreated there after the coming of Rudra. It serves as a buffer between the netherworld and our own. Yep. Ah, uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, well, we don't have too much choice, do we? Okay. And it's now day 14 like I feared it would. But, frankly, it's worth it to get this much accomplished. So join me next time where I join back with Sir Lint, wherever the heck he was again. So until then, this is Melee Wizard, and have a nice day.